Hey kids, in today's lesson we're studying the concept of multiplying two small matrices. Now, given two small matrices in a specific order, you the student should be able to, uh, to determine if the matrices can be uh, multiplied. And if so, you should be able to multiply the matrices yourself. Now, you should uh, be able to recognize uh, that the commutative property does not apply to matrix multiplication. You should know that. With that being said, let's deal with multiplying two small matrices. Okay, well, let's try this first example. Let's see if we can multiply. This is a one by two matrix or a one two matrix. It has one row but two columns. This is a two two matrix. It has two rows and two columns. Row one, row two, column one, column two. With that being said, you should pay attention to this very important aspect, the fact that the actual um, number of columns for my first matrix and the number of rows for my second matrix have the same value that lets you know that you should be able to multiply these uh, matrices. So that's why you want to pay attention to the actual dimensions of the matrices that you're trying to deal with. What will result is a new matrix. It will be a 1, 2 matrix. That's why you need to pay attention to these values here. The number of rows for my first matrix and the number of columns for my second matrix. Once we are sure that these two values are the same and that we can multiply, we should look here to figure out what's going to be the dimensions of my new matrix, a 1, 2 matrix. Well, let's fill this out. 4 times 1 is 4. 3 times 0 is 0. 4 plus 0 is equal to 4. 4. Next I have 4 times 2, which is equal to 8. And 3 times 3, which is equal to 9. 8 plus 9 is equal to 17. And you notice that just as I predicted, I'm going to uh, have a answer matrix, which is a 1-2 matrix. One row, two columns. Let's look at this one, and let's see if we can um, basically multiply this small matrix, or these small matrices. Okay, this is a 1-3 matrix. One row, three columns. This is a, oh, wait a minute, this is a 2-2 two -two matrix. This is a 2-2 two -two matrix. Because these values here are not the same, my number of columns in my first matrix and the number of rows in my uh, second matrix, I know that I shouldn't be able to multiply. For example, I've got 4 multiplied by 2. That's 8. 3 multiplied by 0. Well, that's 0. What's 1 going to be multiplied by? There's no value there. So we know that we shouldn't be able to perform multiplication in a certain situation. Students, I hope you're able to deal with multiplying two small matrices. Good luck.